Good morning, one and all. Now, in electrical distribution, we are concentrating on the percentage voltage drop of square type distribution area with substation located at the center. A square shaped service area which is served by four primary feeders from a central feeding point is shown in this figure. Now, to determine the percentage voltage drop, consider an area of L by L, nothing but L square, to be fed from the substation as shown in this figure. With a load density of D, kVA per unit area, and then the total load will be S equal to L square D. Since the area is considered to be serviced by 4 feeders, area served by 1 feeder will be equal to L squared by 4 and KVA rating of this feeder will be equal to S by 4 and assume that the load increases uniformly. Then the load is concentrated at 2 third of the length L therefore percentage voltage drop will be equal to 2 third of L by 2 K S by 4 that equal to 2 third L by 2 K L squared D by 4 since S equal to L squared D. Then finally, two third of L by two whole cube K into D. If the load is considered to be uniform, then the percentage voltage drop will be equal to half of L by two K S by four. And already we know that S equal to L square D. Substituting S equal to L square D in this equation, then we can obtain half K into D into L cube by eight. Therefore, the percentage voltage drop will be equal to half K into D into L by two whole cube. From this. This shows that the percentage voltage drop in this feeder varies with the two-third of power of the feeder length. This is an essential consideration of the line length. Thank you.